Hey everybody, welcome to Lonely Things. It's a free little indie horror game. You get on itch.io. Uh, put a link in the description. After a long night's drive, you stop at this remote hotel looking for a place to sleep. Waking up in your room later, you find a note stuck to your door telling you that your car is gone and discover the hotel might be desolate, but is not abandoned. Well, yeah, somebody check him into his room or anything? Uh, watch the introduction? Sure. I've been driving for so long that I couldn't remember where I was going. <laughs> the roads all look the same. The shadows out there never got any closer. It seemed like the night would never end if I just kept on going. All I wanted was a place to sleep. <laughs> I don't know why this, this voice is cracking me up. <laughs> but it had been hours since I'd even seen a gas station. I was about to pass out at the wheel when something began to take shape ahead. A building. Why is it looming out of the shadows like that? Couldn't believe my luck. It looked like a hotel. Does it? Oh, cool. We're in. Ooh, I'm gonna turn up the audio there. Let's see if I can pick up my, uh, my belly rumblings. Okay, cool. Uh, White Owl Motel. Oh, so it's literally abandoned. Okay. There's another little grumble. Let's see if I can get all these. Uh, welcome the managers occupied and we'll, we'll return shortly. Your key has been left on the reception desk. Did I call ahead and say, hey, I'm coming? Uh, please find your room at the end of the first floor west hallway. Get some sleep. You are very tired. Okay. Is this a payphone? It's kind of weird that it's like right there. Hello? All right, so it said first floor west wing. So is it like... Why is it? Why are there like no lights in here? It said first floor. Is this the West Wing? Oh, um, lock. Oh, but the little button down there said go. Do they mean? Oh, they meant up here, but it said one F. This is the second floor. Okay. Room eight. I remember what room we're in. Oh, there we go. Room 12. Nice. Let's look at this nice room. Ah, uh, yeah. Stand up shower, a sink, or a bathroom. Or a, uh, not bathroom, a toilet. I can't even get to. Like, I can't even walk up to it. Would I have to, like, stand in the corner over here and just, like, arc up to get to it? <laughs> what if you're a lady? <laughs> what would you do? <laughs> Oh, hi. I like your suit. You're very dapper. Uh, there's someone in your room. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I guess I just fell back asleep. It's like, oh, there's somebody in my room. Good night. Uh, the bar is open. Grace wants some company. Your car is gone now. So I'm just gonna go get plastered now that my car has been stolen. Oh, this room's open now. Ooh, that looks weird. Also, this looks really dark. I don't know why. Um, I always say that, then whenever I edit it, it's actually not as dark, but whatever. Uh, let me filter gamma. Let's turn you up a little bit. 16 looks good. Yeah. Yeah, cool. All right. I want to make sure you guys can always see what's going on. Dot, dot, dot. Is someone there? Oh, it's like a intercom. I got myself stuck in here somewhere. Can't find the, can't find a way out. How long have I, oh, I don't know. It's hopeless. I'm afraid. 
I should be, I should just accept reality. Come back and listen to me once in a while, okay? All right. Cool. See ya. Sorry that you're stuck in this crappy hotel. Uh, so it said the bar was open. I wonder if it's down here? Also, what is this rug? Hi! Okay, yeah, what is this rug? Like, it's supposed to be like an animal skin? What kind of monster is this? Yo, your face is good. Evening. Looks like something's troubling you. Your car was stolen? Wow. I guess that makes you stranded, huh? I'll keep an ear off for you. It's Joe, by the way. I've got a lot on my mind, myself. I'm waiting on a special lady. Eh? You know Grace? A note left in your room, huh? Grace does strange things sometimes. But she's an honest woman. Maybe you could try asking the manager about your car. Although... Alright, dude. That's... <laughs> I don't like him. <laughs> That's really weird. Alright, uh, let's try to go to the bar. Oh, this is open now. Cool. Let's get drunk! Oh, hi! You look just like Joe. My special lady's not here. Oh, is this Joe? She usually, uh, she's usually here by now. In the corner table over there. Uh, she looks so beautiful in the candlelight. I had a bottle of Sleepy Owl for her. I thought she might even let me sit with her. But the manager, that creep, he took it from me. Okay. So the manager took my car and then took this dude's booze? <laughs> this dude's a dick. At least it, uh, at least it must have, must have been him. He was hanging around my, outside my room upstairs earlier. Said he was fixing the lights. What a bunch of bull. Nothing ever gets fixed around here. All right. What's this? Uh, nothing to light it with. Oh, okay. So I do have to find items and stuff. This is actually a lot more intricate than I expected it to be. Like, I'm actually really digging this. I thought it was going to be like a generic Unity indie horror game. And I was like, eh, whatever. And, you know, I kind of stopped doing those for a while. So I want to dive back in. But this is actually really good so far. It's just extraordinarily dark. Can I fix that? There's even like an item system? There's a saving system? What? This is this is way more complex than I expected. Alright, I'm leaving. See ya. Oh, alright. Yeah, there's where my car was. Alright, see ya. White Owl Motel. And he was trying to give her a sleepy owl? There seems to be like an owl... Uh... Motif going on. Alright. This door looks weird. Looks like water. Oh, this light's on now. That looks great. Room one is locked. Room two is boarded. Can't even see this one. Hi. Are you Grace? They move. Uh, who the who the hell are you? I don't know anything about a stolen car. Talk to Terrence. He's the manager. It's not my job. You'll probably find him somewhere else. So get out of here already. Alright. Uh. Hey, me again. Thanks for not telling Dad I've been writing. Uh. Not much has changed since I wrote last time. It's pretty much clean rooms and sit around. Oh. Is she like the maid? Uh. Listen to music all day. Sometimes stuff happens. You get real freaks out here. <laughs> Uh, I found this plant or something under the bed when I was cleaning uh, room one today. Okay. 
It was the grossest thing I've found in that drunk lady's room, and it, but it's probably the weirdest. It wasn't the grossest. Okay, it wasn't the grossest thing I found in that drunk lady's room. That's probably the weirdest. It moved. Never seen a plant do that before. I showed it to Terrence, and he went all quiet. Uh, took it from me and ran off to his office. Hasn't come out since. The old guy's losing his mind. I never, uh, ever, oh. Ever since his wife disappeared. I'll tell you about that another time. I've been finding my, uh, finding him talking to himself, wandering around the halls in the middle of the night. I wonder what he thinks I'm doing. Uh, it's been three months now since that piece of shit dumped me by the side of the road. Terrence gave me a good deal, so I don't have to pay for much. Uh, another few weeks and I'll have enough to move to the city. I don't know what I'm going to do when I get through here. I don't know why my nose is so itchy. It must be like allergies or something. But like, man, my eyes, my nose are just like going nuts. Sorry if I keep like... Uh, I don't know what I'm uh, going to do when I get, uh, get there though. I'm actually starting to kind of like this place. Don't ask me why. I'll write again soon. Hope you aren't still sick, Jane. Okay. And this, okay, so that isn't the plant, because the homeboy took it. Man, that, that is some smooth jazz she was listening to. <laughs> Alright, come on, bruh. Uh, okay. Hope I don't have to worry about batteries. That's gonna be some kind of trick to it. Here, let's turn these off. Turn you on. Easy. This is the office. What kind of walls are these? intricate labyrinth is this? I want this going to my office. Max would be pissed. <laughs> like I would change the, the switch puzzle every day just to fuck with him. I got rune nine key. Got the sleepy owl juice. Uh, damages log. 29th September. Room nine. Piss bed. Ew. <laughs> room one. Smoking room. Spilled alcohol. Room 12. Not in use. Another room I was staying in. Uh, September 30th, room one. Found another one of those plants in the wardrobe. <sighs> ah, sorry. I can't identify it. Uh, maybe we've got some kind of infestation. First October, uh, room five. Blood and sink. Maybe shaving accident. Cleaned, no charge. I'd charge for blood. Blood, poo-poo, and pee-pee. I, I would charge for all those. Uh, and other bodily fluids. Uh, October 2nd, room one and room seven are having an affair wandering the halls at all hours and making noise. Uh, I found the salesman passed out in the restaurant bathroom earlier. He was unintelligible. Pathetic. <laughs> Mike, insert pathetic meme. Uh, she has a type. They're dragging this place into the swamp. Wow. <laughs> this is so mean. October, uh, October 3rd. Uh, room 3, another red plant. Clogging the toilet this time. What a smell. Lauren said she'd take care of it. I won't argue. There's Jane. Okay, wait. So. What the fuck? I didn't want to, like, start messing with this thing and have it, like, kill me. What? Weird. I was like trying to line the shadows up some way. Okay. Um, I guess let's head to room nine then. This is a lot more intricate than I expected. Huh. I have to walk through the, the maze thing. Great. Okay. Oh, so this is her. So she was in, okay.
Got it. For some reason, I thought she was in like an actual room room. I believe room nine was over this way. But I got that that owl stuff. What's his name? James? What's up, dog? My special lady's not here. Uh, a sleepy owl for her. Okay, but well, the manager of the creep took it from me. Crap. Stop it. Shut up. Here, take. Oh, I, I give it to Grace. Okay, I was going to give it to him so he could impress his special lady. Anything over your... What? There's a small... There we go. There's a small, like, talk chance. That crap. Alright. Well, I put the bottle down, so I guess I have to get Grace in there somehow. <clears throat> Alright, now that I got a flashlight, is there anything back here that has been hiding? No. Alright. I guess let's go upstairs to room 9 now. I love how fast I am with the sprint. That's great. Uh, hi. Someone there. Got myself stuck in here. Can't, okay. It's hopeless. Okay, so this is... Same... Same person. Or same dialogue. Alright, now let's really go to room 9. I wanted to see if they would talk to me and say, Watch out for so-and-so. Yeah, you can actually pee in this toilet. <laughs> so the, the shower head is mounted in a way that would just like blast you in the face. Like. It's, oh, it's like a weird caterpillar thing. Um. Oh, I got lighter. That's cool. Cool. So now I go back down to the bar, light the thing. Let's check my room really, really quick. <clears throat> nope, stop it. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, nothing is really different. Cool. Uh, let's go to the bar and light that. Maybe we can get Grace to show up. I also kind of expected something to change now that I had the lighter. Like spook sequel go kind of thing. Boop. Hi! Ooh. <laughs> yeah! Hi! Are you jealous? I'm talking to your lady. That's my favorite drink. How did you know? I'm Grace. I like your running mascara. Uh, someone stole your car, huh? Well, the good news is that means you can have a drink with me. Maybe not here, though. It's a little crowded. We could go up to my room. Here's the key. I'm in room one. Okay, so he... Er, the... The dude said that she was having an affair with this guy? It's right above us. Uh, you haven't been there before, right? No, of course not. Sorry, just ignore me. Uh, just meet me there in a little while, okay? Oh, and if the manager asks what you're doing, don't mention me. He has ideas about people or how people should behave. All right, see ya. What's up, bro? You think I didn't hear that? <laughs> you're just gonna swoop in on my special lady right in front of me, huh? Who the fuck do you think you are? <laughs> I'm stealing your girl. I'm the I'm the dude that's <laughs> <No>. <laughs> 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 
Still nobody. All right. Um, let's go check with that intercom real quick. I want to see if she ever changes dialogue. So I'm there. I've got myself stuck in here. Okay. I think it's, yeah, it's all the same. All right. Cool. Let's, uh, let's go see Grace. Let's go see our special lady. <laughs> that guy just got totally C-blocked. What's that say? I can't read it. Oh, I can zoom in. Neat. It's like upside down. Oh, hi. Um, I'm sorry to slip a note under your door like this, but why won't you talk to me anymore? That night a few weeks ago, I told you I loved you, and you said uh, you love me too. Now you act like you don't even remember. I can't stand seeing you in the bar talking to those other men. They're all just trying to take advantage of you, you know. Oh, this, so this is from Joe. I'll keep my distance like you asked, uh, but I don't want you to think I've forgotten about you, Grace. I know there is some kind of, uh, you're in some kind of trouble. Is it Terrence? He's been hanging around outside your room. Maybe that's why you've been so distant. Don't worry, I'll keep an eye out, Joe. Uh, alright. I guess let's go down to her little murder room. Oh, no! <laughs> See ya. <laughs> Not my problem. I didn't see this. Slugging the... Look. I'm not really here. Well, I can't walk over her body. Oh, no. Stairs are breaking. What? What the fuck? I don't know, there's blood on the pillow. Why? This is super intricate. This is great. Not what I was expecting. I'm expecting like a few little cheap jump scares and be like, alright guys, there's the there's my shitty indie horror game quota for the week. There you go. Hope you enjoyed. This is great. I love it. Place. Nothing placed there. Okay. These textures are really weird, though. They don't really look like rock. I don't even know what they look like. What the fuck? Hold on. Thumbnail! Huh, that's weird how they did the shadow. I just, I just realized that. Like, the shadow, when you look at it directly... Or like this, it looks fine. Like, it kind of gives the illusion that the shadow is on the wall. But when I move to the side, you can actually see that it's part of the model. That's... that's funny. What the fuck? Where am I? Ooh, hi! <laughs> ah. I think she's dead. Oh, crap. Oh, she has one of the weird plants. Uh, she looked around the table at her family and realized that she was happy. Uh, yet, even in a moment like this, able to verify the feelings, the fate... Able to verify the feelings, the faces of her children... Her hus... Oh. I'm super confused how this is written. She looked around the table at her family and realized that she was happy. Yet even in a moment like this, able to verify the feelings, able to verify the feelings, the faces of her children, her husband, were responsible for, in her, there was still a simmering compulsion in the back of her mind. Leave. Uh, it was something twisted, she thought. Always been there, even when she was a girl. Happiness didn't seem to inspire contentment in her, although she felt every uh, other aspect of the feeling as strongly as anybody else could, she imagined. Everybody else couldn't be walking around with this compulsion constantly threatening to throw them uh, out in their own lives. It felt like it came from somewhere else, 
she wasn't even sure she wasn't superstitious but sometimes she just uh, sometimes just before she fell asleep she could catch a glimpse of a shadow watching her through a window uh, it looked like a little crow <laughs> or else was very far away uh, she couldn't she would hear it whisper things like it was pressed up against her ear interesting yoink so what'd you do I think she's dead okay so I got a root let's go let's save oh this and this board is or that door is boarded up okay hi all right um oop yay I don't want to go that way yet. Oh boy, it's dark over here. Hello. Hello. Weird. So that says knock. I think that's what I have to do now is just knock. Uh, hi. This place isn't for you. This is the end of the demo. No! Thank you very much for playing this. Please keep an eye out for the full game, which will be released later in 2018. Ah, I didn't know it was a demo! I want to check something really quick. Uh, So I saved here after I got the root. And then homeboy was like, gotcha. So let's, I want to see if that intercom says anything different. But in the meantime, hi, I thought that was great. I, I didn't know it was a demo though. Who the hell are you? All right, so still, I, thought I told you to go away. And I love you. All right, um, go back to the office. Anything in here I can do? Like, it seems like this is going to be a puzzle at some point. I feel like there's going to be something with this later on. Yeah, let's go see the intercom really quick, see if that did anything. And also, this door never opened. I can tell they're, like, teasing a lot of stuff. And I'm in. Like, I'm sold. I'm, I'm down. Alright. No, no, she didn't say anything else. I have the thing in my inventory, right? Yeah, okay, I have it. Bummer. So she just says the same thing. I think it's a she, right? Ah. Uh. Alright, well, I guess that's it. This was Lonely Things. Yeah, this was great. A lot better than I expected. Uh, if you want to check it out yourself, links in the description. If you have any recommendations for little horror one-shots, please let me know. Um, I'm also going to be announcing a new contest coming up soon. So if you know any artists that are really good at drawing, then please let me know. Well, please let them know. Uh, I already announced it on... I announced one thing on Twitter. I'm going to have like an actual contest coming up soon. That was the worst announcement I have ever made for anything in my entire life. A thing is happening at some point somewhere. Have fun, guys! <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching.